Hi, uh, my name is Jeffrey Lopez, and today I'm going to talk about the Chapelle. This is just short story for the on Ginny Narine, a 12 year old Indian girl from Rio Cristalino, a city in Trinidad and Tobago. She, as usual, was walking uh, on a sunny day to the Chapelle to see Father Oliver, a French man with blue eyes and white skin. As she was walking uh, with her umbrella, unexpectedly her, something behind her. It was Ravi Krishnani. He was inside his car trying to give a ride to Jeannie. Ravi was a 21 year old, a tall and lean man from a wealthy Indian family in Trinidad. That's why Jeannie hesitated so much because their difference in social status. But in the end, she accepted uh, the right to the chapel. Uh, instead, Ravi took her outside the town to a sugar field and, de and there raped her. She was in shock, in shock but in she told no one about it. Even with hatred inside, Jeannie lived his lies as normal. Later, later, she heard the news. Wabi Kirjani was engaged with Sunita Morpolani, the daughter of a well-established Indian family in Trinidad, even wealthier than the Kirjani. A few months passed, and while celebrating, celebrating a son's birthday in the Narine house, everyone was shocked when they realized that Jenny was pregnant. Jenny's mother, disappointed and exhausted by the news, Listen to her story about the wave and the Christianist song. Jenny's uh, uh, mother wor worried for, the, for her daughter's future uh, to her to abort. But there, they decided to confront Ravi and the Christianist family. Without spending it, uh, uh, Ravi Christiani accepted the responsibility and decided to marry Jenny. This meant that the Kirjani Morpolani engagement was interrupted. Despite Sunita Morpolani being her, the two families ending in good terms. Regardless of the events, Sunita's brother invited Ravi to their seaside villa in Mayaro. On, the on, the on their way there, uh, while driving in a hill, Surrounded by big trucks, it is said by brother by the brothers that the car door on Ravi's side opened and he fell. Later he was found crushed by a giant truck wheel. Everyone more at Ravi. Some had suspicion, but in the end nothing happened. The case was closed. Ravi's death didn't affect Jeannie's pregnancy, and weeks later she had the baby in San Fernando Hospital. As the nurses saw the baby, they looked, they looked each other uh, anxiously. Jeannie was not surprised after seeing her baby. The baby's skin was white and pale, his eyes were, were very, very blue, used as Father Oliver, use as the French father. Uh, that's all. Uh, thank you for listening and bye.